Hello, Georgia Burns here. Today I'd like to show you how I made this card. To make this card I used the stamp sets, Peaceful Moments, and I used the word Thank You. This is all part of the Poppy family, and Painted Poppies, and I used that on the front, and I used these on the inside. I have got card and papers. I've got a card base of eight and a quarter by five and seven eighths, scored at four and one eighth, folded in half and burnished. I have two pieces of white card stock at five and five eighths by three and seven eighths, one for the inside, one for the outside, and I have actually embossed this one with an old Stampin' Up leaf embossing folder. I have got a piece of red cardstock at two and a quarter by five and a half and I have some designer series paper. This is the poppy paper at two and one eighth by five and three eighths which will sit on top like that and I have another Piece. This is two and three quarters by four and one eighth. So this makes that two and five eighths by four inches, and which we are going to stamp on like that. That seems a bit bigger than that. Oh, just a little bit. Doesn't matter. So. Yes, so all we need is this at the moment to stamp on and the inside piece. This can sit away for a minute. Right, I'm going to use my black Versafine and the flower, ink it up. Turn this long ways and I'm going to stamp that to the left of it. That's nice. Clean it up. Then with the word thank you, I'm going to pop that down here and draw, bring it closer to me so I can see it. There we are. Now with the field of flowers as I call this stamp because there's a load of flowers and that's what they look like in the field. I am just going to run this across the bottom of the paper like that. No, I need it down a bit more. In fact I need a piece of scrap. Let me see if I can find a piece of scrap. I want it to come right to the bottom. So I'm going to hang the stamp over the edge. That's better. And then just another bit there. Oh. Let's just put some more down there. Cover up my little mistake. do is colour these in and I'm using 
Old Olive Light for the leaves, as I always do. And for the stem. And then, oh yeah, put a bit of green in this bit. And then with real red, dark, dark, I'm going to colour the poppies. You can go around all the edges first. There's that one coming in. And this one, I just went and coloured all of them so that they look. Quite nice against the white. Oh, I think they do. I'm not doing these particularly gently. these little flowers. I would have said nearly done if I hadn't made the mistake of another half a dozen flowers to colour in.
concentrating so hard on not talking. Right, last one, I think. Yep. That's quite nice, doesn't it? I think it does. Right, let's stick this card together. So, yeah, that goes on there, and that goes on there, and that goes on there. So, Let's put this on. There. I like this paper. That on there, that on there, let's stick this on the inside. And then we want to stick this on our card base who's extra um, glue on this with it being embossed and put that down like that like this piece is going straight down and that is going to go it's a little border each each end and this will go on dimensionals on there All right so let's see how many I've got I've got enough Right. Glad when my delivery comes. Alright, um, I'll pop that just there. Right, I never put gems on this one. I'm gonna Put some black ones on, I think. Let's see what I've got. I know I had 
some tiny black ones. Here they are. No. I've got enough for the three best cards. Uh, one there. One there. This one, we'll go there, that one up there, and that one there. Hope you like that. If you do, give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more of my cards, please subscribe. Um, and if you press the bell icon you'll be notified of any more videos I upload which will usually on Monday, Wednesday and Friday all I can say is thanks for visiting and I hope to see you again soon